12 for Pernell Whitaker's double. Chavez can't threaten to pull out. Woodruff. Fighting. This is just the anticipation is great. You can feel that because he's abandoning what he says. He's more emotional here tonight before 63,000 plus in San Antonio than he was. For contrary on your opponent. Yes, sir. And, and that opponent is Pernell Whitaker. Pernell's moving so quickly that it will frustrate Julio Cesar Chavez in post. He's landed. This is the kind of stuff that's going to his pace a little bit because you know what Davis is this time. For me and this wild. Round to start unloading. Oh, the referee's trying to break him up. He wants to put some hurt on this guy. Let's get this over with. Top of the head of Whitaker. Whitaker doesn't seem to be punching that hard. Whereas Chavez looks long night, but if he does, he himself could be first shot. Nice shot up here. But we have judges from foreign countries. Oh, good action. That could bode well more for Chavez. Caught Whitaker too. I think both of them a little off balance falling into it. Chavez looking to ball in. That snapped Whitaker's head. Whitaker the hitting on a break because it's now happening that Whitaker's doing it. Pernell. He's got to do something to keep him off. If not, he's punching away now. Another good shot. Round two. I charge you, keep looking at this body punching. Watch the devastation as it's going to start to mount up. That's in the kidneys and one under in the liver. And when Whitaker. He doesn't just run and vacate the premise. Whitaker, Whitaker with the jet. More than Chavez is. Nice. See, he's, but, he, but he is landing, and that, those are so far. Good bite right here. Something else Pernell does is roll with the punch as well, so it oh. minimizes the shots. A good right hook. Good. Look at the jab that Whitaker's using, a double jab, effectively. You see that jab eventually gets in uh, Chavez's way and sets up. There was, there was a low blow there, and, and Pernell looked at the referee as if asking for a little help, and the referee stopped and gave him both a warning. Calling by Pernell Whitaker. Let me put, hey. Whitaker's hand and foot speed. Are on Joe Cortez. He pushed him. And yeah, this is something I don't totally understand. But Chavez unloading. Got him in the midsection. Taking the offensive. Nice right hand. Right hand by Pee Wee. Oh, and a left to the. That oh. blocking move. Was that out of a football field or something? It looked like a cross floor. Oh, you see. So, and so now, sweet. Joe Fraser certainly did to Ali in his fight. Three round, guys. Three seconds in round four. Another effective round. Right hand by Chavez, and back comes Whitaker. Final seconds of the fourth. Two rounds, and now this fight's even. And now Chavez he's having to begin round five. Four. Relentlessly. But back comes Whitaker. To the judges, how do they judge the big body shots and the little quick, how do they score them? To our England and Switzerland. Because they love intelligent boxing in the Alamo Dome in San Antonio. Been too elusive to this point. Shot, he is dropping his hands to get him down near. He's doing much better this round than he did the last two, in which Whitaker even took the offensive. Just came through with a nice flurry. Some of those uppercuts, what they call a shoe shot, they just throw them real quick and flashy, and they're for more of a visual effect than they are to be effective. Round up to this point, only had 11 seconds to go, got a little breath of fresh air here. And so did Switch, because Chavez at this point had already won the round pretty big. He didn't need to go any further with this. Just a little attack. Round six, scheduled for 12, the WBC. But more importantly, the right to be called the best call. Uh, well, he squatted down. He's he buttocks shot by Chavez. He, now to the head end, bumped on that. And is being away from harm's way. Johnson going to mount up. Oh! oh the low blow by Whitaker. Continue round six. Let's see how this affects Chavez. Oh, again, again another one. Oh, right, oh, oh, right back. But Chavez getting infuriated, and he landed right in. Cat and mouse game again in the corner. Watch Whitaker's hands now as he throws it right there. Now, and right here's the second that, one yeah, again. Right back, right back. I, I mean, almost the exact same punch. Keep punching as you've done all along. Don't. Whitaker has never had a knockout past the seventh round. Let's see what happens in Chavez country. Cortez has continued. Joe Cortez is leading. It's not an illegal shot, and it hurts like hell. Penetrate the cranium of Julio. I think that Pernell Whitaker is discovering that. Pernell Whitaker has been getting it. Another. 
according to the W. Uh, frustrated. He's almost walking after good, st solid balance. Tempo. And he's frustrating Chavez to. Then he goes to the belt. What? Right now, things don't look good for Chavez. Take a look at at Whitaker. Look at that. Chavez. Again, Whitaker's being sharp, using the jab. Boom. Right. If he could punch Bobby when something. Leo Cesar Chavez, we have ever seen. As it comes out for Roddy. I saw something not only in the left stands, but that was because of a bad back. Left hand there got in by Whitaker. Certainly is stronger as the round goes on. He's actually appearing to be a little weaker here. And as this is happening, Whitaker's taking a little more control, getting a little more accurate, and I'm carving a play. The other judges, England and Switzerland. Chavez now continues to come forward, but he... Pie, does Whitaker at 147 fight Terry Norris? Well, that yeah, is a long fight, and we got a long neck. Oh, no blow, 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 blow. I, I, I'll tell you. Chavez! A clean shot! Whitaker continues to have his the seemingly invincible Julio Cesar Chavez undefeated 87 and 0. Whitaker ooh. is what happened in the Meldrick Taylor fight, which was that he went so far behind he needed a big finish to pull this one out. At the tremendous job Whitaker is doing, a body shot, another shot to the face, and away he goes. A more punching Meldrick Taylor. Now later in the round he's doing the same thing, he's, and he's actually taking it to. Now, but he's started here. Well, he's got this round in his hands if he to throw more punches like that. Right hands, some terrific body shots. And Again, the strap. Oh, left hand. Chris Flick. Purnell Sweet Pete Whitaker, for the most part, has had his way. Bobby may be right. Tired. And Whitaker showing his strength just a second ago. There's a left hand, a quick left, snapping for the Chavez fans. See, he's tentative. He's tentative. Chavez is not. Slapping because I hate to have to favor up Chavez. I'm speeding him. Feel these last two rounds. And the same thing being said over in Chavez's corner to set ultimate badge the first man to beat julio cesar chavez put inspiration is beginning to be written all over chavez's face we've just been informed that the odds are into the fight well the answer is the Meldrick, the Meldrick taylor fight was Meldrick was actually considered oh, to whitaker he looks nice and oh. nice right hand left. whitaker with the left hand crisply and look at the punishment that Whitaker inflicts here. He's in command, his punches. Little sneaky quick stuff. Hurts, rocks, moves. Chavez called that a gift from God. Whitaker, but the referee said nothing. Even God can only be so great. Whitaker continues to impress. Ch if Chavez loses this fight, I predict he will retire. Oh, he's got his own title to defend. What a team to come forward and finish. Whitaker in the final 10 seconds. Let him. Too elusive. History. It could be history in the making. The decision is a majority decision a draw. A draw. And you can see the reaction of Sweet P. Whitaker.